We continue our series tonight honoring people who have been lost to the pandemic. CBS 2's Natalie Dudridge remembers a father and a grandfather, both taken too soon. Arthur Nelson was known as everyone's uncle. Born in 1946 in Bay Ridge, a die-hard Yankees fan, Artie married the love of his life, Lorraine, who he nicknamed the General. He had two daughters and four grandchildren he called the Junior Generals. The grandkids would always sit and wait for their grandpa at the front door. He was the life of the party. Even after retiring from a career as an iron worker, he worked at a local bar, still bartending at 74 when he got sick and tested positive for COVID-19. On April 10th, his wife brought pastries to his nurses to thank them, sure her husband would get out soon. While in the lobby, she got the call that her beloved husband had passed away. It was her birthday. She says she'll never be able to celebrate it the same way again. Instead, on that date, the family will celebrate Artie's life. Idris Bay will always be remembered by thousands of first responders as the man who taught them life-saving skills. A Queens resident, Bay began his EMS career in Brooklyn, was a 9-11 first responder, and became a lead instructor at the EMS Training Academy. Everyone called him Mr. Bay. He was the only person they addressed with that title because he exuded formality. He always said sir, ma'am, and had the most perfect manners, except for when it came to Jeopardy, his favorite show. Bay got sick with COVID-19 in mid-March. He took a medical leave and never returned to work. He was 60 years old and leaves behind four children, two men whose legacies live on through their impact in their communities. Natalie Dudridge, CBS 2 News.